Hey, I'm Thomas Serpok, an Associate Administrator for Science. And I'm Lori Glaze. I'm the Director of Planetary Science Division at NASA. And we're so excited to have selected Dragonfly to go forward as the next New Frontiers mission. It's the science that really motivates us to do this exciting and difficult mission. A mission that has elements of advanced instrumentation, but also has the ability of flying in that uh, atmosphere of, of Titan, uh, a world that we, of course, looked at with Cassini and Huygens, our international uh, analysis with uh, ESA and the Italian Space Agency. And what really excites me about this mission is the fact that Titan has all of the key ingredients needed for life. Liquid water and liquid methane. We have the complex organic molecules, carbon-based molecules, and we have the energy that we know is required for life. And so we have on Titan the opportunity to observe the processes um, that were present on early Earth when life began to form and possibly even conditions that may be able to harbor life today. We may be able to look for biosignatures there today. So what an exciting mission. And of course, that mission is led by principal investigator, Dr. Elizabeth Turtle at uh, Johns Hopkins University Applied Physics Lab, but also by a core team that really brought together a very diverse uh, group, uh, close to 40% female, but also an engineering team that brought just now, just a couple of years ago, brought together the Parker Solar Probe, a very hard technological uh, challenging mission, uh, brought that together uh, below cost and on schedule. So we're really excited uh, to see what's going to happen here. Go Dragonfly. Go Dragonfly.